Well, it's middle of August 2022. We're up in the whites. Ezra and I are going to sleep at the Sawyer Pond tonight. Hiking along this lovely stream. You like this one? I feel like they're all this size. You might be right. Well, let's put our stuff down, and then we'll just go and explore a little more. Oh, we got a little bear hang right here for hanging the food. Oh, look at that. That's cute. All right, here's our little setup for the night here at the. Sawyer Pond campsite. Tried to get the smaller platform because I don't like taking up a big platform when it's just us, but our tent didn't quite fit on that one. So we decided to come down here to platform number one. Beautiful spot. Every spot comes with a actual fire pit, which I was surprised to see. So we might have a little fire tonight. It's uh, very nice. It's in the low 70s. A nice little breeze, no bugs. Welcome to the inside setup. We've got Papa's setup right here, his sleeping bag and mat, and then this, um, my sleeping mat and my sleeping bag. And then there's a bunch of pockets on the ceiling for our knick-knack cataracts. And yeah, that's the inside of our tent. So we made ourselves a home. We relax now, it's only three o'clock. Might take a dip in the pond. Get in there. You feel it before you shout people, get in there! Get in there! Oh, oh! Yeah! Yeesh! It's nipper! Nipper good! Bump, bump, bump. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Lots of sticks and things. Yeah, like I said, very dirty. Ah. There. Ooh. How is it? It's a new pay.
Papa is cooking up his dinner right now. He's making some beef stew, bench time meals. Two servings, but he'll probably be able to eat this. I might have a nibbling of it. Um, I'll have mine later. Mine being some Alpine Air home style chicken pot pie. So that should be good. Yeah, that's the water boiling. Just went down, fill up some more water with the filter. And we're cooking in front of a beautiful, lovely sunset. And that's how you tear open a bag. That's some gruel right there. And the gruel gets rejuvenated. What you got there? Be stew. Cooked. That's hot. Hot. Ooh. But it's good. Head down. Really good. I might leave it, leave it open for a minute mm. to cool off. Man, yeah, it's good flavor. Looks good. Yep. Mine is cooking away in there. I should have it soon. That's it. Oh my god, I can't. I got myself a nice good juggle of water. Yeah, did pretty good scrounging for wood. Only dead wood, of course. Yeah, we're, giving, we're giving this thing a shot. So it's an ice cream sandwich, but dehydrated. For science. For science reasons. That's why we're eating it. Oh, that's cute. It's wrapped up like one would be. Yeah, it's basically like... It does taste a little ice creamy, I will say. Yeah. Not bad, honestly. But it is. Tasty treat. Uh-huh. A torch. How'd you sleep? Yeah, me too. So this group rolled in just before sundown and it looks like they made a food chandelier for a bear. Give me a break. You're a hot chocolate, my lady. Good it's beautiful here. Lovely spot. Enjoyed our day yesterday. Night, not so much. Loud folks. Not even that they were loud, it was just that they're late. And they can't help that it echoes so much. I mean, they were being loud till midnight. Yeah. They were up till midnight screaming. Damned college kids. Well, we had a lovely afternoon yesterday at Sawyer Pond. At night, not so much. 20 minutes before sunset, a group of 12 college kids rolled up and uh, they were screaming and laughing until midnight. That sucked. I just couldn't fall asleep. And then our 
sleeping accommodations were not great. I used my old just fold out pad and it didn't provide much comfort. Nasri tends to toss and turn and so the inflatable pad was just making noise for her all night. So neither of us got a great night's sleep. That's the way it goes sometimes. But I'm not going to let that dissuade me from recommending Sawyer Pond. Just make sure you go on a day that could be quieter and you'll have an idyllic experience. Well, thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss our next adventure when we hike up Mount Washington, the highest peak in the Northeast, and stay at the Lakes of the Clouds Hut. See you then.